military intelligence? Microsoft Works? Government organization? Agile efficiency. Hi, this is Gary. Welcome to Development That Pays. Do you know this picture? We looked at it back in episode 34. It's Henrik Nyberg's illustration of how to and how not to create a minimum viable product. Now, this creation of a whole series of MVPs, a skateboard, a scooter, a bicycle, a motorbike, is the very opposite of efficiency. It's a journey full of detours, dead ends, and U-turns. Efficiency would be going straight to the final step, going directly to building the car. That would avoid a huge pile of work, but it would also avoid a huge pile of learning. Learning about what the customer really wants. And without the learning, we're sure to build the wrong car. And customers won't buy the wrong car. Am I saying that efficiency has no place in Agile? Well, not exactly. I'm all for more efficient stand-ups, more efficient planning sessions, more efficient retrospectives, more efficient deployment processes, more efficient, well, you get the idea. That's all good. But when it comes to the software, when it comes to the product, Remember, it's not about being efficient. It's about being effective. And as we've said many times before, it's not about doing the thing right. It's about doing the right thing. I do hope you enjoyed this episode on agile efficiency, the oxymoron. And I'd love to hear your thoughts on it. Please take a moment to leave me a quick comment in the box below. If you'd like more videos like this, there's a new episode of Development That Pays each and every Wednesday. Click on the big red button to subscribe, and I'll look forward to seeing you on the other side. Cheers for now.